we are given the positions in as a function of time we need to find the trajectory so we are given the two equations we'll eliminate time and we'll get a relation between y and x which is our equation of trajectory then velocity and acceleration so we just differentiate this and we'll get vx and vy differentiate again we'll get acceleration in x and acceleration in y direction then at what time velocity forms an angle pi by 4 with acceleration so this is the velocity vector we can write in i and j form similarly acceleration also we can write in i and j form so we can see here that acceleration is along minus y direction and velocity is in this direction so in the fourth quadrant positive x axis positive x component and actually my bad we don't know where it will be in general case but they have given that it forms pi by 4 angle and we know that x axis is positive for the particle so if it wants to make pi by 4 angle it has to be in the fourth quadrant it cannot be here because the velocity in this quadrant then its x component will be negative but that is not the case because the x component is positive it has to be in this quadrant and this angle is given as pi by 4 so obviously the x component divided by y component of velocity that they are equal that's why it is pi by 4 so that's what we will do a so pi by 4 means mod of vx is equal to mod of vy so a is equal to a of 1 minus 2 alpha t which happens at t is equal to 1 by 2 alpha now ideally it should be plus minus so if you do it other way around you will see it will be 2 alpha t minus 1 so let us write both the solutions and we are going to reject one of them because at t is equal to 0 you can see that it will be in the first quadrant so we need it to be in the fourth quadrant so our acceptable solution is 1 by 2 alpha